Chair covers. I hate them. I did them once and I was like, never again. But I do know about them, so I will tell you about them. Right here, we have got a spandex chair cover over a regular folding chair. Uh, I use a company called Ultimate Textile. They have several different chair covers. I highly suggest if you're gonna do chair covers that you order one of each because you need to go actually see the chair and test it out. Not every chair cover will fit on every chair. So you gotta have all of them so you can see which one best fits. Now this one's spandex. Spandex is generally the way to go because it will stretch around most chairs. Right now it's on a regular folding chair. I'll show you how it looks on other kinds of chairs. Um, they do take a while to put on, so you have to account for that. A lot of times people can just buy them online for cheaper than you would rent them for. I wanna rent them between four to five bucks a piece because they take a while to put on. Um, I would rent them a little less, maybe 350 if they wanted to get pick them up. Uh, but they're annoying. I hate them. And then you gotta clean them. Like this one right here, uh, you can't really see on camera, but it's dirty. Uh, oh, here's the spot. It's dirty. Uh, I don't like cleaning linens. This one, I just picked up, you know, I asked someone if I could borrow one. They own their own. Uh, they're not fun, but they're a good source of money. Like if you're doing small things, like, you know, the table toppers, some decorations in the barn or venue or tent or wherever the wedding is, uh, this is a good thing to add on. It'll pick you up some money. You can buy them. You're just gonna have to clean them and wash them, or you can rent them from the linen companies like Ultimate Textile or A1 or Choice or you know wherever who's closest to you. There's a lot of companies that specialize only in renting linens and chair covers and things like that. So let me take this off and throw down a few other kinds of chairs so you can see that the spandex stretches and conforms. Now, the one time I did it, I ordered what I thought was going to fit the chair and it didn't. Uh, there was like a lot of extra material at the top and it flopped over backwards. So you got to remember that non-stretch ones, you have to make sure that you order the right chair cover for it. Some chairs have a curved back, some have a rectangular back. Uh, you just got to make sure that whatever chair you're putting the cover on, you get a sample in and test it out. That's an annoying thing too. You either need to go there to test it out or you gotta have them come in. So it's like this whole other extra step. But a lot of people do them, so just showing you. Okay, so here it is over a padded chair. I just grabbed a black one, a black padded chair. It looks okay. I mean, it's got some of this, but it looks okay. Now, this padded chair is great looking. It looks brand new, but maybe the person doesn't like whatever it is. Maybe they want this chair cover to be pink. You know, they want all pink chairs. So that's what the covers are for. To either make really nasty looking chairs at some banquet hall look good, or make your chairs the color that you want your wedding to be. So this one's on a square top, like you can see, uh, it's formed around that uh, padded black chair. Probably should have been on a white to make it look better. But uh, then let me show you a rounded back. Okay, so here it is on a rounded back chair. It looks okay. This chair is not exactly the kind that you might find in a basement of a church, but it would be kind of similar. So it would fit over one of those like metal, you know, chairs that you find, you know, at the basement of a church or fire hall or something. Um, it actually looks pretty good on it. And then here it is on a shivari chair, which actually looks pretty good. Um, and why would you want to cover up a nice shivari chair? Maybe the venue has nasty ones, you know, all worn out, don't look good. Or maybe they only have silver and it just doesn't match your color. Say you want white chairs, or like I said, you want your chairs to match the color of your linens or your wedding. You want green covers or purple covers. That's why you might cover a nice shivari chair. Uh, like I said, I hate them. I don't do them but it is an opportunity to make a lot of money if you're willing to put in the time and you make sure that you get the right chair cover. And if none of those chair covers perfectly fit, then go with the spandex. And you know, it does look nice when all of them 
like, you know, the wedding's purple and you have all purple chairs and ivory covers and purple napkins, it looks pretty good. But that's chair covers. Thanks for watching.